All right, so I'm going to go ahead and do single Capricorn reading. I had it done yesterday, but unfortunately, I accidentally deleted. Um, <clears throat> and it was so good yesterday because I was really in the zone. And I was able to finish them off because I truly enjoy doing this. So, um, like I always say, this is general, so it may not be your story. It may not, you know be something that you agree with which is perfectly fine um just keep in mind that you can look through several videos to try and find your answer but if you have to keep searching they may be possible that the answer is like right in front of you but we all have free will so these are just what i'm reading from the cards um putting the sign in mind so that way we can draw energy from that sign so we are going to do the read single reading, single Capricorn reading. I'm a Capricorn. I have Sagittarius and Scorpio on my chart. I already did those and they're pretty straightforward. So Capricorn is my sun sign and that's the one that is my main one. So <clears throat> single Capricorn, what have you dealt with in relation as far as relationships in the past, present and future? Single Capricorn. And like I said before, when I say single, I'm talking about someone that's not in a committed relationship. So it's anything outside of like a marriage and a committed long-term relationship. Even new relationships. I'm just talking about those that are in situationships, friends with benefits that could potentially become something real. But at this time, it's kind of in that stagnant um, energy. I'm going to keep going too. <clears throat> all right so we have prosperity begins throat chakra and patience and planning and this is 100 percent capricorn so basically what i'm seeing from this is this is more so this is more so moving towards your future because I feel like with the throat chakra, this is coming from your past. You speak up. So now you're at a stage as far as, you know, if you're trying to date, you speak up about things that you don't like. Capricorn, single Capricorn. So you always make it known. Other people may not like that you're so blunt about things, but you don't care anymore because I feel like your past relationships have caused you to be someone that is not afraid to speak up for themselves. So we have uh, patience and planning and prosperity begins. So this is just basically you waiting on the right person. You don't want to make any hasty decisions to just jump into a relationship. So that's why you're being patient and planning things out. <clears throat> but ultimately you will... Um, bear the fruits of your labor basically that's what came to me with this because there's fruit flying everywhere and people are holding hands so you will be able to build something from nothing with somebody and it actually grow into something beautiful so that's moving on into your future so single capricorn what is going on with your energy for single capricorn for past present and future past present and future for single Capricorn. Past, present, and future. It's funny because these cards actually look a lot bigger when other people do them. And they're so tiny. Excuse me. That was, that was nasty. Alright. So single Capricorn. Past, present, and future. What is going on with the energies with your past, present, and future as it pertains to relationships? Single Capricorn. What's going on with your past, present, and future as it pertains to relationships? Wow. So we have man holding coin, 
holding a coin anxiety hmm. and caring connection <clears throat> so Capric single capricorn i kind of feel like all of this is pertaining to your future and somewhat of your past so i feel like with this one anxiety this is something that's following you because I kind of feel like you're anxious about your future and it all comes from your past relationship. So you're scared of things not working out the way that they're that you want them to work out. And I feel like that's what that anxiety is coming from. Um, when I see both the man holding a coin and the caring connection, what I pick up from this <clears throat> or from these is that you're wanting you're wanting someone that's stable you want them to not saying that you're a gold digger and that he's got to have like millions of dollars but you just want a person that is him i'm saying him because i'm i like men so that's why i'm speaking but single capricorn i feel like you want someone to either match your level of financial stability or come in with more so that's what you're looking for. You don't want to have to take care of somebody or have them live off of you. But I really feel like you want someone that's stable, financially stable. And with the caring connection, connections, this is someone that's going to be coming into your life that's truly going to give you everything that you know you deserve. And he's not going to be like afraid. He's going to protect you. He's going to be there for you, do nice gestures. So that is going to come through and that person is going to be financially stable and be able to offer you what you can offer to others. So let's see what the romance angels have to say about single Capricorn in their past, present, and future. Single Capricorn, past, present, and future as it regards to or regarding relationships. Single Capricorn. Single Capricorn, past, present, future, single cards, relationships. Single Capricorn. Okay. Single Capricorn, past, present, and future. Regarding relationships. Single Capricorn, past, present, future. Single Capricorn. This card is only really want to come out. Single Capricorn. Past, present, future. Okay, relationships. Okay, so we have one. Unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Okay, got my two. Um, we also have you deserve love, you are lovable, and calling in your soulmate, your prayers, affirmations, affirmations, and visual visualizations help bring you together. So Capricorn, single Capricorn. I feel that this unrequited love is someone that held you in this type of situationship situation. So what I mean by that is it's somebody who did find you attractive, who did have some type of chemistry with you, but they didn't feel that enough to make you their woman or their man. So that's what I'm picking up from that. But... I do feel that by this calling in your soulmate and you deserve love, you are lovable. You have to remember and remind yourself. And this is what this anxiety, I feel like the anxiety is caused from your past. So you second guess yourself. You have 
possibly some forms of low self-esteem. You're always constantly thinking like, what did I do wrong? How do I do it better? Blaming yourself. So with this card being here, you are a lovable, per lovable person. So there's nothing wrong with you, single Capricorn. You are someone that someone can be with and that can give you that caring connection that you're wanting. With this last one, calling in your soulmate, you are going to be coming in to some type of a relationship with either someone that you had in your past or a new person that is going to be your soulmate. I kind of feel like this same person, single Capricorn, that gives you that unrequited love or unrequited, I don't know if I'm saying it right, that same person could possibly also be your soulmate. So with that being said, I kind of feel like you need to tread lightly because it could be that this person is coming back into your life. They're going to be just everything that you wanted them to be. And then you're still going to be in this anxiety mode because you're going to be waiting for them to do what they always do, which is ghost you, go no contact without any type of explanation. So that's kind of what I'm picking up from this situation. So if it isn't for, you know, someone coming back, then maybe someone new is coming in that is going to be able to give you that caring connection and they will be your soulmate. I think sometimes people get the idea that soulmates are just a forever thing and I kind of feel like a soulmate is just someone that's tied to you forever, but that doesn't necessarily mean that you guys are going to end up in marriage or together forever. It's just someone that is tied to you for life. That's kind of how I see it. So... With that all being said, single Capricorn, let's go ahead and pull some angel oracle cards or pull a angel oracle card to remind you about what it is that you need to remember moving forward. So single Capricorn, what is it that you need to remember moving forward? What is the message? And again, we have creative writing. Um, Archangel Gabriel, make time to write down your thoughts in a journal or pen, an article or a book. So it's just causing you, I feel like it just is causing you to really stop and think, is this what you want? You want to make sure that you document everything, um, just for your own self. Maybe you're having dreams about stuff and you want to know what they mean to you. Um, and it's just saying, maybe write it down so you can reflect back and find out what it is that you're trying to learn or what it what it is the universe is trying to teach you about something <clears throat> i'm gonna pull one more um we also have overcoming difficulties the worst is now behind you and you are surmounting in pr any previous challenges so just clarification that you don't have to remain in this anxiety mode of course mental health is real if it's something severe, definitely go get checked out. But you have been able to overcome a lot, single Capricorn. And it is your time to have a caring connection and you are lovable. So don't ever think that you're not. You will be getting someone that's going to be on your side. It's just I don't know if that's a new person or someone from your past. But definitely be on the lookout. As always, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed so I can do more videos. And of course, any comments are welcome, whether you like or dislike. It really does not matter because it actually helps me out. So thanks for watching and I will continue doing the rest of the videos for the night. And thank you.